Political news tonight. Results we have waited a week and a half for just came in. In the Democratic primary race for Cook County State's Attorney, the Associated Press has declared Eileen O'Neill Burke the winner. NBC5 political reporter Marianne Ahern has the story. The long wait is over. At the end of today's workday, Eileen O'Neill Burke was the first to declare herself the victor. Shortly after that, the Associated Press also called the race, and about an hour later, Clayton Harris conceded there will be no recount. The latest count puts O'Neill Burke ahead of Clayton Harris by 1,556 votes. While certainly a very close race, that lead is insurmountable. On social media, O'Neill Burke says she is honored to be the Democratic nominee and congratulates Clayton Harris on a hard-fought campaign. She adds, there is so much more that unites us than what divides us. I promise to work tirelessly to help build a safer, stronger Cook County together. Then in a statement from Harris, he said in part, I said throughout this campaign that I would continue to push forward on the urgent work of criminal justice reform. That remains my commitment. Harris had the backing of the Cook County Democratic Party, including powerful chairman Tony Preckwinkle. While the Democratic nominee is favored to win in November, O'Neill Burke does have two opponents, Republican Bob Fioretti and Libertarian Andrew Charles Kapinski. The Board of Elections will certify the results on April 9th, but with the AP calling this race, the long wait, it is over. Marianne Ahern, NBC5 News. Our thanks to Marianne.